Every day we're breaking down this outbreak by the numbers here on Wake Up Charlotte and a bit of a glimmer of hope. That's right. For the first time in a long time, we're seeing below average case counts in both Carolinas. North Carolina saw 1200 new COVID-19 cases yesterday. Take a look. That happens to be the lowest number uh, one day increase since back in June. And the percentage of people testing positive uh, down as well. About 7% of tests yesterday came back positive. Compare that to the, the 9%, 10% we've been seeing now for, for weeks. We've also seen hospitalizations decline for three straight days. So across the board, some solid news for North Carolina. In South Carolina, about 1,400 people testing positive yesterday. A high number, yes, but still about 300 cases below the what is the two-week average there. And for the second day in a row, we saw the percentage of people testing positive at below 20%. But missing again from the data is hospitalizations. We haven't received an update in three days as hospitals transition from reporting to the CDC to another platform. And we know hospitalizations are always a good indicator about how this thing is uh, uh, faring. These numbers are overall, though, a good sign, but don't expect much to change for at least a few weeks. Health officials need to see those numbers trending downward for for several days, possibly even weeks before easing any restrictions.